Hey guys, welcome back. Today we're gonna talk about periodontitis. I uh, remember from my last video I said if gingivitis is not treated, it could lead to more severe forms of gum disease called periodontitis. So let me give you a little background of uh, the anatomy of the teeth and the jaw. So basically you got your jaw bones and then you got your teeth which are embedded in the jaw bone and then you got gums which cover everything up, right? So what happens in periodontitis is uh, in health, you got the gums that are tightly attached, but in periodontitis, the gums become detached, they form little pockets where bacteria and plaque can accumulate. That leads to tooth loss, and if you leave it untreated, unfortunately, it could lead to uh, teeth becoming mobile and loose, and one day it's just gonna fall out. The, the two main types of periodontitis are the chronic and aggressive forms of it. Uh, the chronic one is usually seen in patients older than 30 years of age and the more aggressive one is seen in uh, younger patients. And again, like gingivitis, it could either be localized or generalized and if you remember I said it, that just depends on uh, the number of teeth that are involved. The treatment options uh, is the first phase would be non-surgical where um, either your dentist or your hygienist can do a deep cleaning where they will numb the teeth and the gums and they clean underneath the, the gums to clean all that uh, bad stuff out. That would be the first phase. And then after a period of about six to eight weeks of healing, if we see that there's still unresolved inflammation or if there's still pockets um, that are present, we might need to proceed into surgical treatment, um, which we will get into uh, later in my other videos. And yeah, that's pretty much it for today. Uh, thank you for tuning in. If you have any questions, let me know. I'll get back to you. Um, see you next time. Thank you.